Well, the USWA has been training one of the one of the great athletes in the world here for uh, for the last uh, well, a little bit of time here. Uh, we're going to introduce him to you in just a moment. As far as I know, he is the only Australian rugby player who has made the transition and uh, played in the NFL, played for the Cardinals. Yes. Yeah, so and uh, wait till you see him. As far well, well, let's take a look right here. Here's a, here's a little introduction. This is Colin Scott. The grand finals may be over, but one football hero is just getting underway with his season. An historic season at that. Colin Scott is the first Australian to make it into the real big time of professional gridiron in America. He started off as a schoolboy rugby star, and the sceptics, just as in the jingle, said he'd never make it. But as Jeff McMullen tells us in this report, Colin Scott has become a giant among giants. Four, three, they said an Australian rugby player would never make it in American football. But Colin Scotts took on the biggest yanks they could throw at him. I'm uh, weighing about 275, which is coming onto 20 stone, but uh, there's a lot of, you know, 320 pounders, 300 pounders, which is, you know, 24, 25 stone. Uh, these men are huge. After six years of blood, sweat and tears, he's now the first Australian to play American pro football. Greg from the shotgun. And dragged down from behind by Colin Scott. Little bands, a little yeah. Australian jig after making the play. How hard was it to win that respect? You had to climb over them. Yeah, climb, fight, kick, spit. Um... You name it, they threw it at me. I mean, some were better athletes than me, but they just didn't want it as much as I did. Danny White. And the Cardinals clamp down. Colin Scotts, the first Australian in the NFL on his first NFL sack. Scott said he's going to try his famous kangaroo hop as he gets a sack today, but he, I said, hey, you can't do that in the NFL. It's illegal. He said, I'll tone it down and call it the crocodile yawn. Now, check this out. Hop, hop, hop. <laughs> You've all heard of the refrigerator, man. Well, the refrigerator can move over because this kangaroo has taken over. <laughs> Woo -hoo -hoo! Right there, Colin Scott's headed this way. Rugby, uh, NFL football, and now USWA Championship Wrestling. Glad to have you here. Good to be here, Dave. Very good to be here. I know you've been training for some time now. You think you're ready to climb into that ring and go with your debut match? It's been signed. Well, I'm excited about it, Dave. It's the first time I'm going to be in the ring this week, and uh, I'm really looking, really looking forward to the opportunity. I've been training real hard the last few months, and uh, actually been training harder than I ever did for my NFL career and uh, for my rugby career. So. I'm very determined. I know I'm not going to win every match out there, mate, but I'm going to get out there and give them uh, my best Aussie, um, my best Aussie um, effort. And uh, one thing I promise you, Dave, it's going to be exciting, mate. Very good. Well, we're looking forward to it. I tell you, from some of the action we saw on the football field there, I'm sure it is going to be exciting. Your opponent coming in now, I don't, I don't know if you know much about him or not. He's trying to work his way into the top ten, and to do that, he needs a win. And I'm not sure Eddie Marlin's done him any favors by putting him in there, even though it is your debut match. Talking about the legend, Tony Falk. You know anything about him? I heard a lot about him, Dave. Um, <laughs> yeah, I, I respect him, mate. He's, gonna, he's, he's, he's a great wrestler, and... Uh, 
Speaking of the devil, here he is now, right? Yeah, he is here. Tony, we, look, we don't need any trouble. The match is signed. It's coming up later in the week. It's not going to be no trouble out here. I just want to talk to this guy. Pleasure to meet you, man. I'm the legend, Tony Falk. Pleasure to meet you, man. And I want to tell you something. See, you don't know this Eddie Marlin. He's no good. He's a no good for nothing. He's always trying to trick people. I heard he's, I heard he's a good guy, man. I heard no, he's a good no, guy, you man. see, he knows I'm on my way after Jeff Jarrett and that title, and now he's going to put you in the ring hoping it's going to mess up my plans. Well, let me tell uh, you something. I'm a veteran. I've been around a long time. I know what I'm doing in that ring. Listen to me. I know this is a tough sport. It's not like football. We don't have pads all over our body to protect us. This is a tough sport. So I'm going to tell you what you need to do. You need to talk to Eddie Marlin and see if he can reschedule you a match with one of these jabronis around here. Then you'll probably be able to take care of yourself. You might even get your hand raised, but you don't want to wrestle the legend, I'm telling you. Well, I've heard a lot about you. I've heard a lot about you, Mr. Legend, and I respect what you're doing, man. I know you're trying to get into the top ten and everything, but I ain't getting trying to get to the top ten, man. I'm trying to be number one in this, in this uh, wrestling arena, and uh, you're the one I want to fight. And I'm Australian, mate. One thing about Australians, mate, we don't turn our backs to a good fight, and you, I'm ready for you, matey. Well, I'm telling you, this is a tough sport. It's not like that pansy football. If you get up here right now, I want to show you something. I'm going to show you what a real wrestling hold is. Well, he's been at, you've been at training, yeah, you know. Well, okay. Colin Scott's uh, going to step up into the ring. That bagging up from him right here, I'll tell you that. Match uh, coming up. Uh, Colin's uh, debut match uh, will be coming up uh, later this week. Uh, but uh, the legend, Tony, legend's worried what it is. He need, he would prefer to have an opponent where he can get a, 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 what would appear to be an easier victory. And, and look at the size on this guy right yeah, here. That's My Colin Scott. goodness. And an athlete who's been in training for years, first in rugby, then in football, now in the USWA. And all uh, right, uh, Tony bars that arm. And cuffing uh, him on the back of the head there. Oh, yeah, a little bit. yeah, no, that's, that's not a that's, wrestling hold. No, there's nothing legitimate about that wrestling hold at all. Hey, grabbing him by the hair, putting his face into the mat. That's boy, Tony's version of legitimate professional wrestling holds is, is quite different from. Uh, but yeah. with the rule book. Look at this, he's hitting him. Yeah, just clobbering Scott right across the back of his head. Oh, but look, Scott gets up. Kills Falk, that big kick, and kicks him out of the ring. Oh, well, yeah, and Tony Falk says, you'll pay for it. Yeah, but he got out of there real quick, and I yeah. think Mr. Scott's is going to be able to hold his own against the legend Tony Falk and maybe a bunch of other folks, too. Yeah. Colin, way to go, and good luck to you on this debut match coming up.